jump to the wall. I think those little circle things are collectibles. Yeah, I think so too. Yeah, it has to be it. What, what's this thing? Oh, I can't touch it. Oh well. But see all the zombies? Mm-hmm. Wow. <laughs> Shit. It's like a face. Yeah. Creepy. Let's take a look at these zombies. Some of them I think are ladies or Yeah, I Yeah, I feel I feel like you're right. Equal opportunity zombies. Damn, this kid's strong. What? Uh, yeah, no, no problem. jump up? Kiss, this kid knows how to roll and shit? Yeah. Tuck and roll. Uh, like, see, can you jump up to that pole up there? Nope. No? Okay. Let's see if there's anything. Maybe, there. maybe, can you push on the ladder to get it to go to the other side? That's a good idea. Bam. What if you just move the ladder? No, 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 no that's impossible. No, 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 it's some complicated jump, I know it. Whoa. Whoa. Can I turn that back off? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Why would we want, oh God. Oh, this is so creepy. Oh, it must turn on power to this thing. All right, so we'll be cool. It's fine. We oh, can hide no. behind these poles. So we must turn on power and then probably have to avoid the lights, I would assume. Yeah. That was easy. No, but it like still makes me nervous, you know. And then you got the people twitching on the floor. Ah, ah, ah. <laughs> Here we go. Here we go. Hey bird. Whoa, 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 get up. Oh no. Uh oh.
like holding my breath. But there's like people holding babies right now. One lady was holding a baby. Yeah, I really feel like they're gr they're like raising children to be able to control these things. Yeah. when I shouldn't have moved. Or maybe the dog can smell it. I don't know. jump right you would like jump on top of it like the dog or something you might have or you might have to wait till it comes around to you and then jump back down so that it do you know what I mean like get it to come down there and then oh yeah I, I guess I mean? yeah I see what you're saying get it to go all the way down there and then jump up. Because it's a dummy pup. Yep, it's a dumb dog. why any of this would be set up this way <laughs> unless they were like hey a kid might try to escape someday we better leave all these things set up just perfectly so that if he travels only in a side scrolling motion no I think you get on the thing again and then the guy goes through oh hold on let me think about this Get him all the way up to it first, and yeah, probably get the so the cart is underneath it, maybe. Or yeah, and then Something else, or is it? 
Or do we have him bring the cart over there? Yeah. Oh, yeah, you're right. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Okay. I thought they were going to leave him trapped on the other side. No, this is pretty well. Hey, hey, come back here! <laughs> just, just, just a little bit. No, kiddo! Uh. <laughs> Alright. And now we can have our bunny build a zombie, bring us across the platform. You want to name all the zombies? Yeah! This one's Bill. This one's Bill. He had a wife and kids before the takeover. But now all of his wife and kids are zombies too. Bill had a wife and kids. Maybe he was... Construction worker. Yeah, he was a construction worker. Very hard working. And they say, Bill, you're having a promotion today. And he's like, oh boy, finally the promotion that I deserve. And guess what? They took him into a room and like, this is where they're like, this oh yeah, when you get promoted, you Yay. get promoted to corporate. Yeah. And uh, oh look, that's cool. Hold oh on. yeah, so if he gets on, maybe if he gets on top of. Hmm. So what if? Oh, I know. Well, we can try this. Yeah. Okay, wait, there's one up here. Yeah. I don't know how we get us up there, though. <gasps> Whoa! Are you serious? That is so cool. Wow. I was like, zombie, zombie? And then maybe have... What? There we, we go. Zombie to zombie. Yeah, Bill did get a promotion. He clearly is a, is a manager zombie. <laughs> Has a few direct reports. He's very excited. that. Okay, so I have to time it just right. Okay, I got it. Alright. They're like, what the fuck? But where are we, what are we going I into? Wanna... Is it a pool? Mm, we can only follow our hearts, Stacey. Yep. Surprise, there's a kid. Surprise. Ew. Hmm. Probably have to go grab something. Look at all that garbage in the water. Is this where they're having the Rio Olympics? Mm-hmm. <laughs> oh, look, I can see something down there. Reminds me of The Last of Us. Yeah. I hope the Zika virus doesn't spread from the Rio Olympics. It's already in uh, all other countries anyway. Yeah, but it could spread to the United States. That's the issue. Pretty sure it's already in the U.S., isn't it? I think there was only like two reported cases though. Oh. If it was in the United States, they would have already told all the women not to get pregnant. Yeah. Hey, Stacy. Good news. Good news. Well, uh, no, well, I can't have a baby. That's uh, why you know there's actually a bunch of um, there's actually a bunch of like 
athletes, U.S. athletes that pulled out of the Olympics for that very reason. Mm -hmm. In case you guys don't know, the Zika virus is a sickness that is carried by mosquitoes, and if women get bitten by a mosquito and while contract they're pregnant. while they're pregnant and get the Zika virus, their baby will... It can cause microcephaly. It can cause microcephaly. It doesn't, it's a very it doesn't high chance always. It. It's a very high... It's a high enough chance that they said for women in Brazil to not get pregnant for the next two years. Yeah. So that's a pretty... They don't know, like, a whole lot about it yet, but it is... It's troubling. It can also be sexually transmitted. Did you know that? No, I didn't know that. Yeah. So, if you're a guy and you're thinking, hey, it doesn't matter if I get it. Oh, actually, if you get it, you still get really sick and you can have, like, a lot of nervous system problems. Like, it does, oh. it's not just baby problems. Yeah. Know? Yeah, but I'm saying, like, hey, it doesn't matter. I'll just, you know, my partner's the one that has to worry about it. Nope. This raises and lowers the water. Huh. But it also raises the... Oh, what's this? This kid's strong as hell. Yeah. Yeah, so if you press the thing, the door will close. You must have, I wonder if you have to time it just right and start swimming. Can you, yep, uh, you're right. I don't know if you can make it though, that seems. Well, I was like poking around, so. Oh, okay. got to be something else that we need to do. But there's a chain there. Oops, I died. Oh, you died? Mm-hmm. <laughs> Oopsie. Oh, maybe, no, I know what we have to do. What? We have to go through the door when it, when the water's coming back down, because it'll open again. Do you know what I mean? And we can use the water to swim, instead of trying to do it when the water goes up. Do so, it when it's going down? Yeah, so put the, wa put the water all the way up and go to the top. And then what we'll do is you'll dive down and you'll press the button and then you go because the door will open before the water makes it so that you can't reach the platform, I think. So go. And you should be able to reach. Ha-ha! Good job, Stacy. I love when I solve a puzzle. It makes me feel so smart. It's because you are smart. <laughs> Thanks, Mari. What does this do? What are we doing this for? Oh, it, maybe it floats. Oh, um, we could get to the chain. Yeah. Yeah. This kid is strong as hell. Yeah. Which they must have put like turbo shit in him, you know, when they were putting the brain oh, stuff. Oh yeah, in. maybe he's just like a. He's a he's weapon. Like a super kid. Yeah, and that's why they want him so bad, and they, and that's why they're not killing him; they're just tranking him mm -hmm. because he's valuable. Yes. So they're like no. We've invested too much. There's probably other kids because there's people holding their babies and holding and with kids like showing them. And, like, I, one it, kid, it looked to me like she was hold. Yeah, I saw one person holding a clipboard. I saw one person holding something in the in the way that you would hold, <laughs> like cradling it like a baby. Uh -huh. But the thing itself didn't look like a baby. So. 
Sometimes you know it's like sometimes but you can't tell if it's supposed to look like something or if it, that's just the art style. Here's the thing: when the when like the people were walking by, kids were watching. Mm. It seems like they were being trained or something. Oh, maybe they're like, you know, they it's just like class for them. Yeah. And this kid's like, I don't want to control zombies. I just want to play Pokemon Go. Mm -hmm. Uh oh, what is this about? Oh shit, oh shit, oh shit, oh shit, oh shit. Okay, oh. I, feel, I see. Whoa. What? You I might have it. to just go to the edge of. Can, no, you no, have no. I have to stay underneath the shadow. Okay. How, but how. Wait one second before you go and see how far that goes over. Do you have to go to the edge of the plot? Does it go all the way to the edge? Okay, yeah. somebody with a slinky dart. Oh, I think those are trains of people on them going by in the background. Ew, that's weird. Yeah, you can see them. jump to it? Yeah. Yes, I can. Okay, I did not like that puzzle simply because it's a <gasps> Whoa! Whoa! I don't like this puzzle simply because it's just annoying. You know? Hmm. Uh, I got it. Don't worry. I, 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 feel, I feel Okay. Hold on. Hold on. Oh, come on! Alright. Do it. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry. No, it's okay. It's just like those spotlights. It's like you ever have a puzzle that you can do, but it's just annoying. See, for me, I get there are annoying puzzles, and then there are also like anxiety provoking puzzles. Puzzles where it's, I, and I don't know. Anxiety provoking puzzles, I'm not like a huge fan. It's mm -hmm. like, I, I understand their usefulness, and. But I'm also just, I'm a very anxious person. That's okay, I took Clonopin, so it's alright. <laughs> I took it last night, but it's long acting, so I'm like. Yeah. Maybe that's what I should just do. Whenever we're playing really stressful games, just take a Clonopin. Actually, don't, because that would be a bad coping mechanism. That would be a very bad coping mechanism. Yeah. You should only take your anti, your emergency anti-anxiety medication when it's an emergency. I'm really scared of being like addicted to it. Yeah, I I take mine as a very last resort. I like the like I have one that I take on a daily basis, but then, um, 
I have one that's like, I can take it if it's like, I'm in an absolutely miserable place with my anxiety and like I feel like I can't handle. Alright, so like it took me a while for my psychiatrist to convince me because I'm very anti-benzo, it's because I'm terrified, but she gave me like the weakest benzo you can get and the least addictive one, so it's like, I wonder if the dog can swim. Well, when I mentioned to you, like, if you had something, um, whoa, shit! I have an idea. See how slow it is? Yeah. Where did we come from? Break it off one by one, I guess. Yeah, I'm not so sure about that, man. I think you I... have to wait until they get all the way around the other side. It's just really anxiety for one by two. Right, so they're on the other side. Yeah. Uh oh. What does that mean? route down. Remember we played Dragon Age Inquisition? That's exactly what I was going to bring up because when I started playing it on my own, that's like the first, like, you know how there's that Fuck ladders. That first ladder that you have to go, what is it, down I think? And that's when they like teach you about ladders. And you're like, and fuck I, it. And I walked right off the edge. Yeah, and you were fine, weren't and you? And I was like, yeah, I know how to use this. It's fine. 